six minutes after eight o'clock this morning. And we want to take a live look right now at a stretch of downtown property that could undergo a big facelift. It's a big development proposal that's happening on the South Bank, actually. We're, we have to move that camera right. over a little bit to the left. Exactly. It's over by us, actually. Yeah. It's part of an effort called Healthy Town. We've done stories on it before, mm -hmm. an initiative to make people in Jacksonville healthier, getting those people together to feed off each other. The energy and the potential is great. So just minutes ago, the developers released the new name of the community and a sketch showing what it will look like. After about 1,000 wow. online entries were made to name the project, the development team decided on a name. It is the district life well lived Jacksonville. Hmm. So the project will be developed on 30 acres of riverfront land in the heart of the city, which is right next to basically the school board building. Channel 4's Marcus White joining us now live from the South Bank where that development will take place. Marcus? Well, organizers say that there is a tremendous amount of interest for this project. They say it will improve the health of people in the area. I want to show you the area where they're talking about this development. Just a huge amount of area here as we pan our camera over and show you where this development will take place. I want to also give you some more details about the project. The idea will provide resources for health. There will be retail, dining, and nightlife experiences here in the South Bank. The concept is part of the create a place where you can live healthily and and project organizers want an environment where there's unintentional exercise. That means making healthy choices consciously and subconsciously. Also, one of their ideas is called Generation H. It has an emphasis on the H here. And that really means that there's no age limit to living healthy. So whether you're a baby boomer, a millennial, or part of Generation X or Generation Y, they want everyone to be part of Generation H, which means Generation Health. I want to show you more of this land where that development will take place. The project is still in the development stage and there's no word on when that development will officially begin or when it's expected to be finished. But you can see just a lot of land here and a lot of excitement for the project expected to make a transformation in people's health. Of course, we'll continue to follow this story and have the very latest on the development for you. Also, if you want to read more about the project, you can log on to our website, newsforjax.com. Marcus White, Channel 4, the local station.